Gemini. Hey, 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 Gemini. Welcome back to my channel. Yeah, this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, or wherever you have a heavy Gemini placement. Keep in mind, this is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate for every single Gemini out there. Wow. The first message we have here is we need to talk, okay? So honestly, I'm picking up that this is like a dual energy. I feel like Divine Feminine, you're at this place where you can't really read your person's energy, okay? And I'm feeling like they're feeling the same way about you at this time. It's kind of like this moment in time is serving as some kind of checkpoint within your connection here. I definitely feel that there has been a lot of delays in the 3D here. And there's really a need for you two to kind of check in with one another to see how you both are feeling, to see how this connection is progressing at this time. Okay, I definitely feel you both wanting to engage energetically. Okay, there could be a lot of telepathic communication going on right now. I'm picking up on a very, very um, intense energetic bond between you and your person. But as you stand right now on your journey, I definitely feel like an emotional exchange is needed. I feel like you both are at this place where, you know, you've gotten to a place in the journey where you kind of understand what it is, okay? The divine masculine may not be in a place where they know the, you know, correct terms for it, but as far as the intensity, as far as the feeling, I feel like you both are on the same page, but that hasn't been expressed or you haven't expressed how you feel at this current stage in real time about your connection. So I definitely feel that there may be intense emotions from the both of you at this time arising. Um, very, very high energy, very, very anxious kind of energy. Cause I definitely get the energy of like some type of checkpoint as if you both kind of want to check in. You may be worried. I just got the word worried here. Your person may be worried about you, maybe worried about how you're feeling at this time. I feel like there could be some type of break in the communication or there could be some type of lag or the way that you're communicating is not really getting to the core of an issue, okay? So let's, let's get the next message here. Yeah, definitely at a point in your connection where you need some type of clarity, divine feminine, but I'm also getting that the divine masculine needs clarity as well, okay? And it's almost as if you both know that you can only get this clarity from one another. So there's definitely this energy of wanting to connect, wanting to engage, all right? Let's get the next message here. Wow. The next message we have is, I didn't choose you, my heart did. Wow. Okay, so what I'm actually getting, okay, I'm picking up on a very, very powerful connection here. I feel like this reading is gonna be extremely specific because I'm actually getting that you and your divine masculine are actually marrying these energies towards one another right now. So it's almost as if your person is coming through, letting you know that they didn't choose you, their heart did. So upon coming in contact with you, your person was extremely cautious, extremely careful about how they were navigating this situation. Something created a barrier. There was some type of time barrier. There was a location barrier. There could have been age differences. I'm getting that you experienced multiple delays within this connection in the 3D based upon how you both aligned on this journey. And your person is coming through saying, I didn't choose you, my heart did. Meaning that where they were when they first came in contact with you, okay, was not in alignment for the level of intensity and the feelings that they have for you. But you know what else I'm getting as well? Divine Feminine, you relate to this energy, okay? Because I feel like you both are getting to this place where you're realizing that your hearts chose one another, that this was an uncomfortable, you know, situation to navigate through for the both of you, okay? I'm picking up on heavy dual energy. You both are at this place where you're realizing it's almost as if you're getting a glimpse into your counterparts, 
emotional process, what it is that they're feeling and how they are currently navigating the situation or how they felt while navigating. So I'm definitely feeling like although this was your person's initial reaction, they're realizing, wow, this may have been the Divine Feminine's initial reaction as well. I'm not the only one who had to journey through this. I'm not the only one who had to go against the grain, okay? So yeah, that, that could definitely be stemming from this energy of you both wanting to kind of connect here. You both really wanting to merge together and kind of experience this connection from a higher perspective. This is beautiful. So I definitely feel like there's some type of emotional breakthrough that's happening at this time where you're looking at your person compared to when you first crossed paths to right now and they're looking at you as well. It's almost as if you have um, just another layer of compassion for them. They have another layer of compassion for you now. It's almost as if you're seeing each other with a fresh set of eyes at this time, really realizing that you both, you know, were kind of doing your own things. You crossed paths. You felt this really intense pull towards one another, something that you cannot turn off, okay? Something that you probably could not explain at that moment. You know, this connection is very, very rare, but it's also very sacred. So I'm also getting that, even though you were feeling these intense emotions, you couldn't open this up to, you know, anyone. They couldn't open it up to anyone. It's almost as if because you were feeling so intensely about one another, you kind of went your own separate ways here and probably projected a lot of these emotions on one another. But now you're coming into this realization that you're on this journey with your person together, okay? This is a major, major emotional shift that's happening within this connection but i feel like this this energy is very very specific okay let's get the next message here wow the next message we have is do you know how hard this is for me okay whoever is aligning with this message you definitely have an extremely powerful connection with your person. If you're wondering how it is they're feeling, they're feeling exactly how you're feeling right now, okay? You can actually be picking up on their emotional process here because Divine Feminine, I'm picking up that you're at this place where somewhere along the journey, you realized that you were putting in you know, a lot more energy, a lot more effort into this connection simply because you assume the position of the feminine energy, which means that you may feel intensely the emotions. You may be in a position where you're willing to be more vulnerable. You're willing to be more expressive in this connection, right? And this hasn't been easy for you, okay? So it's almost as if you're looking at your masculine saying, well, do you know how hard this is for me to be the one who is willing to open up my heart space, to be the one who is willing to, you know, sometimes wait, experience these delays here in the 3D, but still feel this really intense, really passionate connection. And I'm getting that the masculine is coming through saying, well, do you know how hard this is for me? To feel this level of intensity, to feel these emotions, but not have the words not have the tools to really express this to you, okay? So I definitely get that there's there's something happening here, okay? This may not resonate with everyone, but there's something happening as far as emotional expression and the divine masculine and divine feminine really looking, taking a really deeper look at themselves and one another and realizing that even though they, they hold two different positions, in the connection, maybe on two totally different paths, their journeys have been literally identical, but they've been expressed in different ways, okay? This is absolutely beautiful here. I definitely feel there is a shift and there's this really need. You may definitely feel your person pulling on you a lot at this time. You may be seeing 11-11. This is to let you know that you and your person are aligning, but I feel like this is an emotional alignment or recalibration sort of that's happening here 
where your person is looking at how much you've invested, Divine Feminine, and you're looking at how much your person feels, but is not really able to express to you, okay? But that still doesn't take away from the level of intensity, the dedication, okay? You both may be at two very different places as it pertains to in the 3D, but emotionally, there's, there's something happening here, okay? And there's really a need. Whatever is taking place in the 5D here, it's, it's really wanting to manifest in the 3D here through a conversation. But this won't be a normal conversation. This is real talk, okay? This is like that raw, authentic, let's get to the bottom of this. This is what I've been experiencing. You know, have you felt this as well? really, really connecting, really looking at your person and realizing that there's nothing under the sun that you can say that's going to shock them or surprise them and that you're both on this same journey, okay? Although you may stand in two very different places, you're both navigating the same journey. You're feeling the same level of intensity, okay? Wow. Let's get the next message here. Yeah, this Divine Masculine is definitely looking at the feminine, like really admiring the feminine, really feeling like you are extremely brave because although they have felt and they have really, really, you know, experienced the same amount of things on this journey, you may have assumed the position of being way more expressive. And Divine Feminine, you may have definitely experienced situations in this connection where the masculine energy did not affirm you in many of those positions, okay? And you may have felt some type of shame around that, you know, some type of guilt, some type of ill kind of emotion around being as expressive as you were here. But I'm getting that your person is looking at you actually appreciative because there's been many moments where if it wasn't for you being so open, so brave, so honest, so vulnerable, okay, that would have really, really shifted the dynamic of your connection, okay? So I'm definitely feeling like your person is, is in this place where they're appreciating your, your con contribution to the connection. And they're also realizing, you know, that where they stand on the journey, although they felt the same way, they weren't able to express this, but it's kind of like they want you to feel where it is that they're coming from here. And I definitely feel like this, this is a major, a major breakthrough, okay, that they are initiating. Powerful energy here. Let's get the next message. Wow. The next message we have is we are like magnets. Yeah. I'm definitely picking up on an extremely powerful, sacred connection here or bond, okay? Where although you both have definitely experienced delays, you have definitely um, felt as if this masculine has come up short on this journey here. I feel like you both are at this position where you're realizing the level of magnetism that is over this connection that a higher power is kind of over this connection here. And it's almost as if this, this energy is so intense, you know that all roads lead back to your person every single time. I'm definitely picking up the energy that I'm tapping into right now. You have been through your ups and downs on this journey. This has not been, you know, just something that's been extremely um, positive the entire time. You've definitely had your emotional strings pulled on a lot here with your person, but I'm getting that you both are realizing at this stage of your connection that this is something that you can't turn off, okay? And it almost feels like the minute that you give up, the minute that you've had enough and you go your own separate ways, this is how both of you feel. All roads literally lead back to one another, okay? And it's almost as if when you come back in contact, it gets stronger and stronger and stronger. So if you're resonating with this so far, you definitely had some type of emotional um, barrier and you had a barrier around emotional expression. Divine Feminine, I'm getting that you know how your masculine feels about you, but 
their, the fact that they could not express this to you has caused you to really show up in this connection, um, really, really not feeling as if you can continue with, with the dynamic, okay? And I feel like your person is definitely picking up on that. So this energy that I feel right now, it's almost as if you both are at this place where you kind of need to check in with one another. You kind of want to see how it is that your person is feeling. I'm getting you really, really want to talk to one another. There's a huge need to communicate. There's so much that has gone unsaid. And I mean, even if you communicate with your person, I'm feeling that it may be surface. And you both are at this place where it's like, look, we're in this together. We both are feeling this. Divine Feminine, you're heavily intuitive. Even if your person doesn't have the, the tools to tell you, you feel it. You know what it is that they're feeling. And the fact that they can't open it up and say it to you makes you feel some kind of way. It triggers you a little bit. Okay? And your person knows this. And I definitely feel that this could be an element that has been missing in your connection. You may definitely feel like your person's inability to openly express in a real, raw, authentic way what it is they're feeling as they're navigating the same journey as you. You know, this has really made you feel some type of way. This is a deciding factor in how you move forward, Divine Feminine. Okay? You're definitely at this place where you need clarity. And your person knows that. And I feel like they definitely want to come in and give you this. Okay? They feel the energy shifting. Also, with this new moon and cancer energy, I definitely feel like relationships are at the forefront. So your person may very well be thinking future forward. They're thinking about how they want to show up in love. And they're realizing that the way that they were navigating this situation was not helping them because they've had to repress a lot of the emotions. They practice a great deal of constraint as it pertains to you in this connection, Divine Feminine. And they're realizing that this is causing major delays within their own lives as well. Okay? So this is a very dual energy. You both are feeling like no matter where you are on your journeys, you somehow always lead back to one another, okay? So now you both are posed with the question, how do we move forward, okay? Are we going to get more, you know, authentic with one another? Are we going to get more raw with one another? Um, how do we continue to move forward if we know that, you know, our love story has already been written, okay? This is a very, very huge huge shift that is happening in this connection right now. Wow. Okay. Let's get the next message here. Yes. We have, we're better together than apart. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. You are realizing, you and your person is realizing, I'm definitely getting that this is the masculine energy initiating. So Divine Feminine, you very well may feel very, very um, high levels of anticipation, okay? Because the masculine energy is ready to kind of initiate this dynamic shift here. Very powerful, okay? But yeah, they're definitely realizing that you're on the same team. You both are literally navigating the same journey. Just because they have a different way of expressing than you do, doesn't mean that they don't feel, doesn't mean that they are exempt from the ups and downs, the emotional pulls, okay? That this connection is invoking within both of you here. And I definitely feel like this is kind of a breath, a breath of fresh air for you, Divine Feminine, because I feel like there's really this deep need for you to be affirmed within this connection here. If you could just hear from your person and hear that, you know, they feel the intensity too, that they think about you all day too, that they're thinking about how to move this, um, this connection forward in the 3D as well. Even if they were able to communicate, look, um, I don't know how we're going to do this, but I'm trying to figure it out. Even that would give you, you know, a little bit more motivation to stay, you know, connected to them in this way. Okay. So yeah, I definitely feel like there's this, there's this joining forces energy that I feel very, very powerful energy that I feel where you're both realizing that you're teammates, that, you know, 
you you know you're you're on this journey together okay you're not against one another you're on this journey together and i feel like you both are kind of at this this mental and emotional checkpoint where you're trying to decide how to move forward in the best way and i definitely feel like you both will be moving forward without this barrier around the communication i think that that if you're resonating with this that has been the number one issue within your connection with your person them not being as expressive them not affirming you you not feeling like they're a safe space to express okay so this is definitely shifting and this masculine energy is initiating this shift okay so they would definitely be contacting you there will be room for communication here okay i'm definitely getting that there's a need to approach this communication that's coming in very very gently okay allow them give them space to talk give them space to really express themselves here because i feel like there's a great deal of constraint like there's a lot of repressed emotion that i'm feeling here that is boiling over at the surface okay let's get the last message here wow yeah we have, you have a decision to make. <laughs> okay, I definitely feel, like I said, it's this dual energy. So you'll know this message is for you and you're feeling this energy, you're wondering how your masculine is feeling, they're feeling the same way, okay? You both are at this place where you're deciding, okay, to move forward as a united front. Even if you are separate from each other, even if you're at a place where you're experiencing some type of delay here, I definitely feel like there is some type of huge checkpoint that's happening right now where you both are agreeing to move forward together. You're deciding that it's better for you to be on the same page than for you to be on two totally different pages because now you're coming into the awareness that you both are actually on the same page. There's just two totally different ways of expressing that, okay? And I feel like a lot of the same things that your person has experienced on this journey, you definitely have experienced it as, as well. When you came in contact with one another, you know, you probably didn't know that this would change your life forever. You didn't know that you were a part of this super rare, um, otherworldly kind of love, this collective, this twin, this twin flame collective here. So it's almost as if, you know, you both are kind of saying to one another, look, this this is bigger than me you know and my heart chose you so i've been trying to navigate the same journey that you've been trying to navigate here and you both are realizing that no matter where life takes you you're understanding that this person this other person will always be a part of you okay so yeah this is very very powerful energy again this message did come through i feel like it's very very specific this may not resonate with everyone but yes um this is the message that i have for you all tonight if you resonated with this message be sure to hit the like button on the way out and i will see you all in the next video bye bye